My name is Joao Moraes and I am the writer of this book, Things That Make the Heart Go Faster. It's a collection of short stories. It's my first collection, so it's quite a lot about this city that we're in now, Cardiff. When people think of Wales, they often think of um, the landscape because it is quite vast and empty in its hinterland. But then down on this South Wales coast and up the valleys, it is actually quite urban which is uh, reflected in my book. I, I, I couldn't imagine writing this book in any other way apart from in my own dialect, using the words that I hear from people all around me. Um, without doing that, it just wouldn't be an authentic book. I think readers quite like that sometimes because they learn new words and new forms of expression which they might not have actually thought of uh, in, in the first place. <laughs> If you think about our most famous celebrated poets, lots of what they uh, wrote um, is some of the most lively language that you've uh, ever seen. The next day is Thursday and I go out for food with Tom. He insists on going to this cool new place on the edge of town called the Old Bus Station. I've been to places like this before. The old bus station is an authentic Shoreditch style pop-up street food eatery with authentic Shoreditch style vintage upcycled fittings and authentic Shoreditch style inflated rip-off prices. For the amount Tom paid for his third wave Marxist pulled pork slaw bomb, he could have convinced the family of a small boy to part with a transplant ready kidney. In the corner, being watched by a bunch of people sat on old grammar school desk chairs and benches made of pallets is one of those guitar keyboard bands that hunch over their instruments as if they're a bit apologetic about getting up on stage to express themselves. Tom says, what are you having, mate? I'm thinking, craft beer names are getting more and more ridiculous by the second. I swear I just heard someone ask for two starved interns and a pedo biscuit. I'm saying, I'll have a bottle of the Ramona Lisa. I'll be back in a sec, just gonna go and try and find some signal. As I walk through the exhibition space at the back, I think that the more art shows I see, the more I want to stick a piece of wood to a loaf of bread and join in. I nod at the big doorman, the one with the shiny gold tooth and the SIA license strap tight around his arm as the cold outside air hits me. And all I can think is that I wish Tom had agreed to my suggestion of a few pints down the lamb and flag and a half and half from Abracababra.